Iran's surface-to-air missile what's unique makes Russia fascinated. Shoigu and Iranian Minister of Defense Mohammad Reza Gari Ashtiani, visiting an exhibition displaying some rare and first-time displays of Tehran's latest weapon systems, Russia and Iran expanded their defense partnership to an unprecedented level, interaction between Russia and Iran on issues related to the transfer of modern weapons, especially advanced unmanned aerial vehicles, WUVs, is continuing. Shoigu and Iranian Minister of Defense Mohammad Reza Gari Ashtiani, visiting an exhibition displaying some rare and first-time displays of Tehran's latest weapon systems. This included a first-of-its-kind product 358 anti-aircraft loitering munition, which Iran is believed to have supplied to proxy forces in Yemen and Iraq, but has never previously acknowledged its existence. Hard details about the 358's capabilities and its mode of operation remain limited. It is around 9 feet long and has a slender cylindrical main body. It has three distinct groups of fins for maneuvering and stabilization in flight. The 358 is understood to be launched from the ground using a solid fuel rocket booster which falls away after it burns out. The missile then transitions to an air-breathing propulsion system, possibly a small turbojet, much like a traditional land attack or anti-ship cruise missile. Air inlets are visible along the body at the rear of the missile, molded into the engine section. Beyond its core design, Past reports have said that the 358 further deviates from typical surface-to-air missiles and that is apparently designed to fly at low speed to a specified location, and then loiter there until its fuel runs out. The weapon flies in a figure-eight pattern and looks for targets. The New York Times reported in a story citing unnamed U.S. military officials back in 2020. How exactly the 358 missile spots and tracks its targets is unclear. The 2020 New York Times story said that the weapon sensor ring, look to be designed to help defeat existing countermeasures, meant to confront infrared homing surface-to-air missiles, like directional infrared countermeasures systems and decoy flares, implying that it was, in part, a seeker. Altogether, the viability of this concept remains an open question. The low speed of the missile already means it is not useful for engaging fast-moving combat jets in many scenarios, and is better suited for attempting to intercept slower targets like helicopters and drones. To date, there is no hard evidence of a 300 58 shooting down anything, despite reports that attempts have been made. A United States military official said that the 358 missiles from Iran had been fired against American drones flying in Yemeni airspace, according to the 2020 New York Times report. 